Ramadan Kareem. We're now in the month of Ramadan, and now that you're watching this video, you're probably fasting or you want to fast. If you want your fast to have more rewards, then you should watch this video because we're going to talk about some of the things that we should do in this holy month of Ramadan. Stay tuned. Okay, the first thing that we have to do is that obviously while we're fasting, we don't just refrain from foods, drinks, and intercourse. We also have fasting of the soul. And so we have to be careful that we don't commit sins in this holy month. Of course, Allah has said that uh, Satan is shackled in, uh, in this month. And, you know, the means for sinning is not as much as the other months, but we still, it's still possible to commit sins. And that is why we have to refrain from committing sins so that our fasts would be accepted by Allah. Now, the second thing that we should do, you know that the Noble Quran was revealed in the holy month of Ramadan. That is why the Prophet told us that if we recite just one verse in the holy month of Ramadan, it would be equal to reciting the entire Quran in the other months. So that is why it is recommended that we recite the Quran as much as we can in this month and at least recite the whole Quran once during this month or even more if we can. The third thing that we should do in the month of Ramadan, well, you probably know this already, supplicating Allah. I mean, it's really obvious that we have to pray to Allah in this month and ask Him for whatever we want. If we want our sins to be forgiven, we have to pray to Allah. If we want something from Allah, we have to pray to Him. But there are certain prayers that are dedicated to this month. And uh, given the fact that Allah says in the Quran that He's really close to us in this month, and he answers our prayers more so in this month than other months. We have special supplications. For example, after the obligatory prayers, we have supplications such as, Ya Ali, Ya Aween, Allahumma adkhil ala ahl al qubur al surur. And we also have uh, supplications during suhoor meal. The suhoor meal has a special supplication. And also after iftar, again, we have. Dua iftitah, another special supplication that we recite after the iftar meal. So in general, it is very much recommended for us to pray to Allah, to supplicate Him and ask Him for the things that we need because our prayers will be answered during this month. Well, up to now, we talked about things that almost all Muslims do in the month of Ramadan. But now for this fourth one, not all Muslims do the things I'm about to say. And that is on the night of Qadr, the night of ordainment. You know that the night of ordainment is a, you know, a, a night on which everything is determined. Everything that is going to happen in the next year is determined by Allah on that night. So it's a very special night. It's better than a thousand months. And it's if you like even perform one prayer, uh, it's going to be multiplied by a thousand or even more than a thousand because Allah says it's better than a thousand nights. So what do we do? We keep vigil. We stay up all night long until the morning and uh, we recite certain supplications like Jawshan al-Kabir. Okay, it's a special supplication. It's a pretty long one too. And uh, also we hold the Quran on our heads and we swear by Allah, the Prophet, and the Ahlul Bayt. And then we supplicate Allah and we pray to Allah and say that, Oh Allah, I'm swearing by you, the Prophet and the Ahlul Bayt, to give me a really good year for the next year, to make good things happen for me in the next year. So this is another thing that we should do in the month of Ramadan on the night of Qadr. So these were four things that we Muslims do in the holy month of Ramadan. 
I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do subscribe to our channel because we're going to have many, many videos about the holy month of Ramadan during this month of Ramadan and you don't want to miss those videos. So please make sure to subscribe, hit that bell icon and uh, I'll see you guys in the next one.